I'm Melissa Stevens. I graduated from Hawkeye in the spring of 2017 with a liberal arts degree. My brother told me about the partnership program that Hawkeye has with UNI, so I thought that that would be a really good path. I came up to Hawkeye and I toured and I liked the campus, I liked the size, I liked the feel, and just the overall welcoming atmosphere that it had. So I decided to come here and start my college career that way. I thought Hawkeye really would be a good stepping stone just to you know, I go and get some school, and then I fell in love with Hawkeye, and I enjoyed my time here so much, I didn't want to be done being a student. So I ended up transferring to UNI, and I studied social work. So I got my bachelor's in social work, and I'm currently getting my master's in social work. I work at Cedar Valley Community Support Services, and I oversee a 24-hour house and help adults with disabilities kind of continue their daily living skills, help with behavioral stuff, and all sorts, that's all types of different things. I love working, and I love what I do, so I, I don't know, that's just kind of, if I didn't love it, I wouldn't be doing it. Hawkeye is not a big school, and it really is kind of like a close-knit family. You find your you find your people, you find your hobbies and your clubs, and you get involved, and you have all these experiences, and you know, Hawkeye was that for me. I was an honor student. I was in Pi Theta Kappa. You know, we did the blood drive, we did all sorts of things through PTK. I was a part of the seven original people to help start and expand the food bank on campus. You find out a lot about yourself through a college experience. You find out where your strengths are, you find out who you are, you find out, you know, your different interests, you find out what you're good at. And I know that when I was in high school, I thought I had it all figured out, and I think I have it all figured out, but I know I don't. And I know that if I didn't go to school, I would not be where I am today. 